건일 때에 다시 배를 매번 내요 1, 2년 새 이젠 show me naked vacation This is my dust plug for my iPod Watch how the sound quality is about to significantly improve You will notice the difference Do you know before when I said that the quality is about to get a lot better for the audio? I lied because guess what? I forgot to turn on the microphone Yes Let me just flick this over so you can see my t-shirt which says Tokyo Story I think it's quite relevant to today's episode Episode? Well, today's video I'm gonna be trying some Japanese snacks This is gonna be the smallest haul you've seen Maybe I was gonna do this video when I was at uni with one of my friends who does Japanese He was gonna bring over some snacks and we were gonna do a haul then I was gonna do a Chinese version it was gonna be great but um, we got really busy so it wasn't possible <laughs> Instead though, today I'm gonna show you a few snacks that I got from Tofu Cute so basically, I recently got some banana haichu and my mom really liked it so then the next time I went out I got grape flavoured one and then I just thought why don't I go online and look for like a bundle so she can try a few different flavours which is when I found this it's a Halloween edition I've got some cola sweets I've got some bubble tea flavoured lookalike chew thing there, there we go Say hello to my hamster Esme Esme Lorda She's in here right now She's awake Esme Lauder after a certain brand Esme say hello You're so cute She pulls through the weirdest faces Esme's on the floor there, when she decides to come out of the house I will show her to you Let's just start with the snacks The first thing, oh I'm not gonna lie I already tried this one in the morning Cause if you know me, you know that I love rose Flavoured things Even the flower itself, that's my favourite flower I love the flavour, I love how it looks Just love the smell <laughs> I just like rose, okay? Typically speaking, the flavourings used for sakura is either cherry or rose, I found. So I got these mints. It's super small, looks like a tablet. I'm not gonna have another one because I've already had it, but basically it tastes really nice. It's not minty flavoured, like it's not mint and sakura, it's just sakura. But I feel like it would be good after you have a snack to cleanse your palate slightly, you know? The second thing I'm gonna try today, it didn't come in the trolley, I just did that for presentation because, you know, I'm a YouTuber now. <laughs> Oh god These Pucho Chewy candies I'm British, we don't call it candy Sweets I guess it's a chewy flavoured sweet The packaging is very similar to the high chews I bought But it's bubble tea flavoured It smells like tea Oh my god I love bubble tea Oh it's very chewy It's very hard Oh my god Oh my god It tastes like tea It tastes like tea Wow Guess what I had for dinner last night? I had a heated pancake with cheese inside and then I had another one with Biscoff and trust me, they're really good so try that combination <laughs> Oh, can you see my tattoo by the way? I didn't want to flex on you but just flex flex my tattoo just, you know Yeah, look at this This looks like an advert Oh my god, how do I It's fake but don't worry about that <clears throat> I know what to do over there. <laughs> Esme, music! Music, Esme. My verdict on this is that it tastes like tea, which is really strange, but it tastes like milk tea as well. I think it's really nice, but I definitely couldn't have a lot of these in one go. I'll let my mom try all of these later as well. Wow. She's not gonna shut up for a while, so I'm sorry about that. This is chaos. Second thing to try is also a chewy sweet and it's cola flavoured. They come individually wrapped, looks a bit like bacon. It smells quite strong because I can already smell it. Oh wow, it's so soft. Look at that. Wow. Mmm. -hmm. Yeah, not gonna lie, this is better than the other one. If you think of those red lace sweets that we have in the UK, it's kind of like that but cola flavoured and even more stretchy, rubbery, soft That's a lot of words there, pick one, go with it I like that Well there goes my healthy breakfast, you know Healthy brunch even Next, I've got what we came here for This Halloween pack of Haichu sweets Is it even Haichu? I don't actually think it is It is Morinaga Morinaga? Okay <laughs> Whatever comes out first is what I'm gonna have. I've picked up the small aquamarine one. Big words. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh! It's green inside. It's green and white on the side. It's apple, and it's like, mm, I like the flavor. It's quite strong. It's really good. 
I also really like ramen, you know, the Japanese soda drink. I wrote a blog post about it years ago. If you want to read what the drink is, I will leave a link in the bio because yes, I have a blog and I have had one for about six, seven years now. <laughs> and you can get some sweets that are ramen flavored. Ramen is basically like a lemonade, but it doesn't really taste that lemony. And then there's lots of other flavors. But the interesting point about them is that the glass bottles, which they come in, they have other versions now, but typically they come in a glass bottle. It has like a marble at the top and you're supposed to put the lid in and then the glass just moves, the marble moves, and then... Well, it only gets to like here. I'm not explaining this well at all, just read the blog post, okay? I just put the light on. I don't know if you can tell. This is like the most chaotic video i filmed. Let me know if you like it. <laughs> this is meant to be a short video. <laughs> ah! My little baby, why don't you come out? I'd give you some, but you're not allowed to have any. I have treats for you. This is her food. She really likes the corn, and I would feed her one, but she hasn't come out yet. I also bought her some treats yesterday, strawberry and raspberry flavoured ones, but she has a Russian dwarf hamster, which means that she's prone to diabetes, which means that I can't give her treats often. In terms of sugar, I know this isn't a hamster video. I should make a separate one. Hmm. But since you're here, in terms of sugar, she has so far tried grape, mango, and strawberry, and white rice. And she's a fatty, so she likes it. My children's. Come on, Nidia. Her name's Esme, but I call her Nidia sometimes because it's like a family joke to call all of our pets Nidia. If you know, you know. Niduga. Niduga. Niduga baby. I mean, the weirdest sound for her, but it's our language, you know. She gets it. Oh, she came out. My child. Say hello to the bibbles. It's time for you to eat as well. You don't want it. You go. Have it. Oh, there you go, she's eating. Well, you can't really see it, but... She's eating, and I'm gonna eat now as well. This is the one that I'm most excited for. It's dango, and when I went to Japan, I couldn't find any. But to be fair, I wasn't looking very hard because I got distracted and I didn't think of it. Isn't it right? Mm, yeah. But I love chewy flavored things, basically anything with glutinous ingredients. This is different to mochi, apparently, because it's made with rice flour. Well, mochi is made with rice. Seems to be covered in sugar. Almost choked on dango. <laughs> I keep trying to say this and it's not working, but basically, I like this. That's the simple way of putting it is that I like this because I love chewy flavored things. Chewy things, not flavored, duh. I bought some glutinous rice flour so that I could make something like this at home. And if I ever make it, there will be a Chef Like Nabs episode. Don't even worry about that because it's going to be a mess and you're going to want to see it. <laughs> It's me. Chill out, bro. Chill out. I guess that's the end of my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you've tried any of these before. The thing that I really want to try is the DIY kit. So like when you make sushi, but it's actually a sweet and it just looks like sushi or something like that. Problem is a lot of them are haram. So finding one with the right ingredients is difficult, but I'm going to look for it. Let me know if you think I should try anything else. Have a great day. Esme sends her regards. I'm going to show you more of her soon. Just flexing again. Flex. And this stupid scarf is so slippery. Just stay like that. That's how you want to be, isn't it? Um, bye. <laughs> well, Esme, do you mind? We're trying to be professional YouTubers and you're just not. You're just not. The microphone's on now, so now you can tell what I meant, right? This sounds better. I'm so sorry that I forgot to turn it on. But like I said, that was a chaotic video. She. Oh my god, she's on my shoulder! Wait, where's she going? Wait, Esme! Esme!